It has been said that when in the course of human events, an oppression so revolts its subjects that it becomes necessary to alter or abolish the means of that tyranny. Why do we sit down when all should be standing? And why do we back down at the critical moment like a running away from the waves of the ocean? We head for the hills with the high tide approaching as sand slips away from the castle. When it's time to stand up. Liberty to me is really just the absence of violence towards other people. It's uh, being able to act freely. The ability to do whatever I want, as long as it's not hurting somebody else. Minding my own business and staying out of other people's business. It's also taking responsibility for as many of your own needs as, as you can. It is respect for the absolute right of the individual to be left absolutely alone. Liberty to me is not being ruled by another human being. Liberty is very simple. I cannot be free if I cannot be left alone to have my own plan. Our crew is reaching out to those who truly want to live a life of liberty, where they can feel free to do the things that are most important to them without fear of any force or aggression. Our film will be exploring the liberty movement in America, beginning with the unifying campaigns of Ron Paul in 2008 and 2012, and leading up to the current schools of thought and the ideologies that are prevalent today. But more than that, We'll be looking forward to a future where liberty is not just an idea, but it's a way of life. When you believe in liberty, you can always appeal to people whatever their general political viewpoint is. A lot of people, I think, are just, they're ready for this stuff. It's like, it's like statism is forcing us into this region where everyone's kind of leaning in this direction. We would start by just having less government and then taking a while to assess learn our lessons, deal with our growing pains, do a little less government. I think we need to develop our own little core groups of, you know, bartering system and underground system. Bitcoin is one of those things and I think that could help bring these things about. I think we really all need to start relying on each other. I would like to see people get more involved locally, going to their meetings, government meetings, getting in their faces of the politicians and actually holding them accountable. You do it peacefully. You do it, you know, with persuasion. You do it out of a sense of love. You do it because you want you know, the best for you and your family. And that extends to everybody else's. There's no central plan for freedom. I mean, if you want to go in the political arena and help change minds and so on, you know, peace. You know, I, I don't care. I, I do it all the time. But to think that you're going to vote yourself free means you have not been paying attention. Politics is just a reality TV show that is put there to distract us from the fact that we don't have any choice whatsoever. Don't ever think that the system is ever there to support anything that you have to say against the system. If the voting process is not secure, then our very democracy is at risk. I guarantee you, in the future, government is going to be bigger, stronger, and it's going to take more liberty than it does today. Until the entire empire is no longer financed, then it, it, I think it will continue on like that. I put my hand on your shoulder and I go, whose life is this? You know, it's yours or somebody else's. Once you get that, I go, okay, well, welcome to freedom. We all know that anyone's words could be twisted to fit a given agenda. That's why we will be releasing every minute of footage we capture on a new distribution platform our team is currently developing. If someone featured within our film resonates with you, their interview will be made available in its entirety. If we film 200 hours of footage, you will have access to all 200 hours of that footage. The whole objective is to spread the word, to just tweak something in your audience's head that sticks with them so that they think about it and that will lead them to the proper conclusion. Make no mistake about it, people who try and do the right thing and people who try to, to lead will be targeted and there will be consequences. We interrupt this promotion with the following message. We will defend defenders of liberty. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. I have a dream that, that the government collapses and the dollar collapses and not a single person dies over it and we just keep going and everything just gets better. I really believe that when enough people stand up and say no to government power, government action, and enough of us just decide to start doing things without their permission, uh, there's not much that government can do to stop us.
With your help, we can travel the country and speak with the most brilliant minds of the movement about liberty, personal freedom, how to achieve it, and what it means to our families and our country as a whole. So please, contribute today and join us for the journey. Allow people to see the inner workings of the movement and those people who are making things happen. Join us on our journey. Dig deep. Join us on the journey. Give as generously as you can. Join us for the experiment. I hope you'll contribute. Join us for the journey. This is worth it. This is being part of something that will give you a legacy that your children, your family, and your friends will certainly be proud of. So please join us. Join us. Join us. Join us for the journey.